Hello everyone and welcome back for another episode of Pokemon Sweet Tooth. Let me fix the music for you. There we go. Last time I defeated all of these grunts. Cool. And now I can uh, take on the Battle Bakery, which I will do. They're all gone. You've got a knack for battle. That makes me want to test, to test you myself. I'll be waiting inside. They're not gone for real, but okay. Uh, did I lose the Poké Sender? I did. I broke the sound again. The sound breaks so easily, it's tied to the menu, because it's always when I go in the menu that it happens. Um, and I don't know what makes it happen. I don't know why it bugs out like that, or what I could do to avoid it. So, uh, yeah. Every now and then, I'm gonna have to restart to just fix the sound. <laughs> That's so cheap. Holy shit, they replaced the guy at the beginning of the gym by a trainer that spots you almost immediately if you just go up. That's so cheap. Uh, you won't reach the leader that easily, I mean, if you're using cheap tactics like that. That's Kitart. So, that is Strawberry and Blueberry, which means that Cherry Rain should be effective on it. You can Cherry Rain me if you want. Alright, then I'll Razor Leaf it. I will not Double Edge, because Double Edge would be wasted on that. Like, I've just hurt myself for nothing. Uh, another skid art, so again, Cherry Rain into Razor Leaf. It's probably just gonna cut the cat, yeah. Which does less damage to me than the recoil of Double Edge, so even if a Double Edge, a double edge might kill them, uh, I would take more damage doing that. No, I don't want that. I want the subject of random things to talk about. Uh, this this next this next one is gonna be fairly random and fairly not like if you know me you personally you know that this is what I've been doing in the last few like days slash weeks. Um, but I've been playing Black Myth Wukong and I'm getting near the end of it and I'm excited about that. Uh, there's also a lot of games that came out that I'm interested in, uh, that came out during the month of August, like at the end of the month of August, and there are a few more that will come out, like, ac actually during the month of September, October, and November, there's a few more games that will come out, like at least one per month, um, that I'm looking forward to, and I have decided that I will not get them or play them until I'm done with like the game that I'm playing actually currently, so I'm playing Black Myth Wugong at the moment on my spare time, so I won't buy a new game until I'm done with this one, so I'm looking forward to being done with it. Uh, but there's some of them that I kind of want to stream, but I know I won't really be able to. Also, Darky is evolving. Uh, but I know I won't really be able to be... I was holding the B button to skip text faster. Holy shit, I stopped the evolution. <laughs> I'm stupid. It's okay. Darky will evolve at the next level. Uh, but yeah, uh, I would love to... Um... Oh, it's Koga. It's Koga's gym with the invisible walls. Okay. I would love to stream some of them, but... You're kidding me? You're kidding me. This guy locks you in? Okay. Maybe there's fake walls on top of invisible ones. No? Sunday City Battle Bakery. Uh, but yeah, I, I, was, I was saying I would love to stream some of them, uh, but I won't. 
have the time to, even if I finish this game, I want to get back to Fire Emblem, and then Jaden will have his AC fixed, and I'll stream with Jaden, uh, and I have to either stream one more night per week, which I don't really want to do, or to postpone even more Fire Emblem, which I also don't really want to do, or to stop streaming with Jaden, which I don't really want to do. So, uh, Saffron, Pokemon, Gym Leader, Sabrina. We're not in Saffron. It's not gonna be Sabrina. Winning Trainer's Tofu. Uh, dude, move. Move your ass. What the hell is that? Okay. Okay. Oh, I, I have to make sure that he's not looking at me, because otherwise he just locks me in. That's so garbage. Oh, when you run, they look at you automatically. Right, I forgot that. That this is how it works in this gym. gym. Okay, so don't run at the beginning of that gym, is what I could say, or that battle bakery. Is what I could say, and then I'm just gonna redo the exact same thing. Cherry rain, razor leaf. You know how it works. You can charm me as much as you want, little cutie. You're still gonna die. <sighs> okay, no, they're very cheap. They really pull off, pull on the cheap tricks for this, this battle bakery. If there was an official board where I could complain about like how they made a bakery and how stupid and cheap trick used are in there uh, to prevent people from beating it, like literally just blocking them physically from passing, um, I would I would lodge an official complaint. But I don't think that's a thing, is it? Yeah, in the previous episode I was talking, or earlier today for Twitch, or like uh, tonight, I was talking about a few things that could be done to make this game even better. Uh, I'll had one, and this one I am actually a little bit annoyed by it. Uh, I will had one. Don't make your gyms impossible to complete because someone walked at the wrong time at the wrong place and that an NPC blocks them forever. Don't do that. <laughs> That would be the one thing I would add to make it better. I'm also personally not a fan of the invisible walls, Koga, like the Koga style invisible walls, but that's fine. I, I don't mind that it's there, I'm just not personally a fan of it. It's, it doesn't really test your your intelligence, I feel like. It, it it tests your memory, sure, but it doesn't test your capacity to solve a puzzle. I prefer when it's actual puzzles. Not bullshit puzzles, but actual puzzles that you have to think a little bit to solve, because it still is a kid game. Oh, you add to make him move? Oh, this is... No, okay. Not necessarily. Don't block me. If you just block my path, I swear. No, they don't scare me. They piss me off. I don't care about your invisible walls. I care about your cheap tactics to stop me from reaching the uh, leader. Uh, this is a blueberry type. Now, is the chart is probably gonna lie to me again. Strawberry is good against blueberry and lime is good against blueberry. So let's see if Razor Leaf is super effective. It is. Chart did not lie this time. You can call mine as much as you want. I do not care. Oh, 
All right, I have to remember when I level up to not hold the B button down, because uh, the way I'm having this text pass, fa pass faster is that I hold down B so the text writes is written faster, and then I press A to move on to the next bit of text. And I was just holding B. I didn't even release and repress it. I just didn't stop holding it. And uh, it decided that I it, I pressed it, so it canceled <laughs> the evolution. Uh, so let go of the B button this time, is what I'm telling to myself, as I see that I will indeed level up. I forgot what was the first Pogisui. This one is Mediblue, I forgot what the first one was. Uh, it's, not, it's not even relevant anymore. Like, the previous gym or Battle Bakery showed me that it's not relevant, whatever they have here. Or even the type that they have here. Alright, I let go of the B button. Until the evolution is done, I am not pressing B at all. Actually, the text doesn't seem to appear faster. It used to do that in Pokemon games, because I've been doing that in every single Pokemon game, because I used to do that to go faster. It doesn't seem like it's, it changes anything here. Maybe I should just stop holding the B button. Okay. I'm not even touching my controller right now. <laughs> Okay, that looks kind of good. Uh, it's now a Fudgezor. Alright. Nice. So since I don't know what to expect here, I guess I'll go in with Darky, and I have some clean switches into... or not a clean switch, but uh, unless Darky dies. Uh, but I can switch into anything he's good against whatever he's gonna throw at me. And invisible walls don't scare you at all, it seems. The bombs on my head? Oh, don't ask where I got those. Please. You don't even memorize the layout of your own bakery? Let's just say I don't have the wall patterns memory yet. Yeah. Let's battle. Not Koga, it's Koniro. And it starts with Raticate. So, Blueberry Strawberry. Uh, well, that means Cherry is actually gonna be good. Let's just stay in and Cherry Rain on it. Yeah, I, I'm not holding the B button down, and it seems like it's going at the exact same speed, so I'll, I'll just stop <laughs> from now on. Uh, no, I don't want a double edge, but I do want to raise a leaf and keep some. I... okay. And Razor Leaf to lower itself a little bit? Oh right, it's super effective too, and uh, I'll just Razor Leaf again. Ow. Sucker Punch, that is a banana type move. Uh, dark type either becomes banana or vanilla, from what I've seen. Some dark type moves are vanilla, uh, but most are banana. Mediberry. Raise a leaf again. Ah, ooh. That, yeah, though, it, that, it do got choco moves. It do got choco type moves. Okay, uh, blue. Your time. Because I think milk shot should be effective. Yeah. I didn't even look at the chart, that's just from memory. I mean, I did look at the chart a little bit earlier, so it's cool I do remember what I looked at, like, 15 minutes ago. <laughs> but still. I feel like some of the types I have actually started memorizing some of the types what they're good against. Not what they're not good against, but, you know, that's kind of the thing with Pokémon. The thing you want to figure out is what is super effective against what. That's primarily, like, that's the first thing you want to do. The second thing you want to do is to, to uh, learn is what is not very effective against what, because 
first, you want to avoid using those moves against your opponent, but you also want to switch in your Pokémon that will be the defensive type uh, onto the enemy. So that's the second thing you want to do. So I'm at the first step of I'm starting to figure out what is super effective against what. I'm not quite there yet, but I'm getting there. So this is also Blueberry Strawberry, so I'll just Hyper Fang it. It does have Fake Out. But I'll just Hyper Fang it. That did not do much. Now, Strawberry Blueberry Cherry would have been good against that. Um, what else would be good against that? Raspberry? So maybe I can... No, Raspberry would actually be neutral. Uh, Lime would be good if I add any other Lime move on any of my Poké Suite. So yeah, basically I'm, I'm just going on neutral and avoiding what is not very effective. Um, I'm asleep. I could just die for a clean switch, but I think... I'll switch to Cream Cat. Um, if I'm just going neutral, might as well go neutral with some good stat moves. Now, you can stab me, that's fine. But you know that the fake out is coming. And I crit, that's good. And then I'm gonna bite. Alright, Cream Cat is level 32. Power Stone! Wait, okay. Rock moves, so far, have been Cherry type, I think. Is Power Stone gonna be a Cherry type move? It is! Nice! A special Cherry type move. Now, Cream Cat is more of a physical attacker, but that is 80 damage. Which is more than Faint Attack, but Faint Attack is also will hit no matter what. I do want to keep Fake Out and Bite. I think I'm gonna say no to Power Stone. I wish I could have that on Darky. That would be good. But sorry, Cream Cat. No Power Stone for you. Slash Berry. Berry. That's the evolution of Shrewberry, I think, or Sandberry. Actually, I don't remember exactly how it was called. Um, but yeah, Slash... No, sh it was Shrewberry. Yeah, uh, Shrewberry into Slashberry, so that's a Blueberry type. I just said no to a move that would have been super effective against it, I think. No, 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 it's not. Uh, no, yeah. Cherry is good against Grape, not Blueberry. I mean, it's also good against Strawberry and Orange, but uh, the third one is great, so... I'm just gonna buy. Hello, e -track. I hope that you are doing well today. As you can see, my Cream Cat is fighting a bush of uh, blueberries and uh, lost. Uh, I could bring in, I believe, no, Zesty would not be good against that. Um, Fudge would be neutral, but I have the potential of doing good damage, so I could go with with Fudge. Uh, Barangan, what are the moves that Barangan has? He's got a banana-type move, a vanilla-type move. And look at that. Oh, grape type move, which is not good against blueberry. Um, Alright, let's go with fudge. I'm glad to know that you're doing well. Uh, I'm just gonna double kick. That does not do that much, okay. This slashberry is uh, a potential threat to my team. Oh, it got poison pointed. Oh, the poison might kill it. <laughs> Good. Okay. Unfortunately, I had to take damage for that. Oh, it was his last. I was so good. I thought there was another one after that. <laughs> I think I bumped into another wall. Me. Yes. 
Well, I won't need this medal anymore. It's yours. What medal did I get? The cube medal. Cube? The blueberries are cubes? I don't know. I uh, suppose I should get back to not cleaning the invisible walls. Oh, so that they become more visible. Yeah. Uh, not saying... Not staying though, my phone is low, but I might chat later if I remember. Okay. Uh, see you potentially later. Have a good evening. Uh, and Ko not Koga says good day. Thank you for the hug. Um, so the last two that we thought were grape, and this is blueberry. So that is making me think that the next one is going to be raspberry. I guess we'll see, we'll have to see. Uh, now the you know focus center first, but now the doors to the houses are open, so I can barge in. Smash some pots and oh wait, no, we're not in Legend of Zelda, but I can barge in and talk to people So let's do that Yo, um, how are you? My daughter is so self-centered. She has but a few friends uh, My daughter li likes to mimic people. It's rather vexing. Her mimicry has earned her the name copycat around her around here Wait, that's vanilla game like that that's in the base game that's not that's not special to poke suite people say i copy people too much but isn't copying how you learn new things makes me hungry for soup parfait what will you do if i give you a soup parfait do i buy a soup parfait just for that i guess i want to experience she better not battle me uh, let's buy a super fair. Yes. All right, little miss. What do you want once you've got your food? Wow, a super fair for me. Thank you. I'll teach you how to mimic. No. Just teaching the move copycat. I, like in the base game, why did I not see that coming? <laughs> I think trainers are so cool when they're battling. Don't you think so too? Brock's the last word on cool. End of st Wait, that's also vanilla. They're talking about Brock, but there's no Brock in this game. Now there's a guy who I want to be like. Yeah. A guy that doesn't exist? All of us gathered here are fans of Pokemon trainers. The way they look in battle, they are the picture of coolness. Perhaps you will be talked about here, uh, if you keep winning. I wonder if I can become a cool trainer one day. Okay, well that's nothing. Wow. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm gonna make my way to the next city. Was there anything else, though? No. These tiles are weird and I don't like that. Um, let's just... I have a look at the map. So, yeah, that's... I, I'm not here, map. I'm, like, here. Uh, Sunday City. So I could keep going towards the Tira Grota... The Tira Gro Grota? Grota? Uh, and to Frappe City, but what I'll do is I'll go back to Shug... Mm, no. I'll go back to Candy City, to uh, the Chocolate Chip, and then to Lemonade Port. Um, and once I'm done with Lemonade Port, then I'll see... Do I, I'll probably just go to Glass A City. I'll, yeah, I'll probably just keep going and up to Glass A City. And then Frappe City, but I'll have to visit these all of these routes to see what are well. I saw I know on Route Five what are the Poke Sweets because I caught um, some of the new Poke Sweets that I have there. Uh, route Twelve I only as if I remember well it only add in the grass uh, some Meowfins. 
But I have not seen... Um, I have not seen Route 6, Route 18, the T-Rex Rota, or Route 19, or S Sorbet Island, or Route 11. I'm confused, why are there two Route 12s? Uh, but yeah, so let's go to Candy City for now. And I run this way. I, I didn't see which, which Poké Suite made us fly. I was not paying attention. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Uh, from here I should be able to go down. Uh, Route 13. So that's not Route 12. That's Route 13. Uh, that's the one that only has the cats. The Meowfins, I believe. Oh! It, I... I I guess it, it got Kniezel, too. I don't know what... Okay, let me look up what type it is, real quick. Because that will determine whether I maybe want to catch it or not. Cherry and Vanilla, no. I don't want it. Alright, the water is milky white. Would you like to surf? Yes, Barangan used surf. I'm surfing on my banana gator. Um, is that the way I want to go? So I'm here. I'm here. Oh, okay, Route 12 is... So I'm here. That's the ship. Okay. That's the way I want to go. And then I want to go right. Sorry, I don't know this map by heart yet. Also, let me look at something. Did, did I learn how to rock smash? No. I didn't. Um, I'm gonna go... So, most of the Poké Suite here are probably gonna be... Blueberry. Although, no, it doesn't really mean anything. Uh, sure, I'll just keep Darky out, so that's one less Poké Suite I have to grind up to level... Probably 40 for next stream. Hello, Peepling. You pure vanilla bird with no good vanilla move. Okay, so this is the exit. Hard disk. Probably grape or raspberry from what I see. Hello. Sorry about the wreck. I used to be captain on a chocolate chip. Uh, only, as you see, it's a little broken now. I come back here every day looking for my Lampras. Lapras? Lemon? Probably. I left her here, but I haven't found her again since... Wait, behind you. There. What's that in the milk? Is that gonna be Lampras? It is. It's Meg... Oh, M is not for Mr. It's for Mega. It's Mega Lampress. Um, if it's lemon type, then let me look at the chart. Orange and banana is good against it, which means that my best bet would be Barangan. But I do want to keep... Uh, also, lime is not good against it. I do want to keep Darky out, so I guess I'll just Cherry Rain. It's not very effective, so it's not just lemon. Um, it's lemon and either raspberry, apple, or cherry. Huh. Okay, I'll double edge. Ice shiny. Okay. That's a great move. I am hit with recoil, I know, but I'm gonna keep doing that, because that's my best damaging move right now. Um, and it's doing a whole lot of damage. Confuse Ray, that's fine. I uh, guess I'll... Oh, but both... Let me test... Let me test Razor Leaf. Because it should be not very effective.
Okay, it is. If it had been neutral, I would have lost my mind. Because <laughs> then the type chart would not have made any sense. <sighs> I know that I'm confused. Just hit through, please. Thank you. Wait, don't attack her, please. It, is that my Lempris? Yes, it is, your Lempris. My sweetheart, all this time you were searching the ocean for me. All this time I thought... Never mind, I'm happy to see my Lempris again. Please take this. I've got the Mega Pie, which is the lemon mega sweet. What the hell? Okay. I mean, I guess lemon pie is, is a thing. Some of these mega sweets don't really make sense to me. Um, you know what? Since we're gonna be surfing on Barangan, might as well have Barangan first, so that so that he does the battle, the battling. I had to think for a second if Barangan was male or female, because I I forgot. Um. Right, Lemonade Port. Yeah, that's another team. Is it gonna be the same thing that the gym or the Battle Bakery leader says? What do you say? I'm getting my bird to fly a letter to the north. Oh, so you're the one writing letters to the lady at, at the other city. Okay. Oh, the shop. I mean, I know what I, I know what's in the shop. Hey, I'm trying to fish. I'm out of bait. Uh, do you have an orange berry? No. I don't care. I'm not gonna fight you. All right. Focus center. Even if they are the same level, sweets can have very different stats and abilities. Yeah. This one time when I was swimming, a giant pie gave me a hug. That's That was Lempris. It's true, I swear. Yeah, no, I believe you. Have you caught 25 Poké Sweets already? Excellent, please. Oh, yeah, I forgot I had to do that. I wanted to catch a few sweets just to upgrade, like, in increase that number, but uh, I guess I did without really remembering to do so. It's just a Sooth Bell. Okay, whatever. I mean, Sooth Bell is not necessarily bad, it's just I don't... I don't want to care about it right now. Uh, let's start fighting. Ever seen a giant pie coming at you from the milky waters? Yes. Drop anchor right there if you did. I don't know what you mean, but I've got my banana... my banana gator... against your pie duck. Uh, I don't remember the interaction between these. Pyduck is, I believe, blueberry. Because it's blue. So I might be wrong. Uh, I'm gonna crunch you. It was neutral, but still did the work. Yeah, so I talked a little earlier, I know that this is random, but I talked a little earlier about games that came out or are coming out that I kind of want to play on stream, but I won't really be able to for a few reasons and all of that. Uh, one of those games that did come out is uh, called Akimbot, and I can't wait to play this game because I played the demo and it was really good, <laughs> so I want to play more of it. Um, and that would have been a good one to do on stream, but again, uh, I will not, most likely. But I'm looking forward to playing that game. It's a very Ratchet and Clank inspired game. Uh, same style of humor. Uh, of humor. Mud pie. 
Uh, I do not like it. I hope it gets better when it evolves. Um, I know it's banana type. It's apple and banana. Uh, but yeah, so Ratchet and Clank inspired game, same humor, same, or not same, but similar-ish gameplay. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to playing that game, but I need to finish Black Myth Wukong first. I'm at the sixth chapter in Black Myth Wukong. I'm not going to spoil anything, don't worry. Uh, well, I guess I just spoiled that there is at least six, six chapters. Uh, but that doesn't tell you necessarily much. But I feel like I'm getting close to the end of the game. It's just a feeling, though. I might be wrong. Shiver me tempers! Of course. Of course they- of course they talk like pirates. Like the fishy pirate they are. Uh, so I heard you like... What do I like? What do I like? I don't like pirate dart, no. Uh, what do I like? Volpi? Or pies? Oh, they're all pies! Pirate. I'm such an idiot. They're all pies because they are pirates. Okay. I believe Volpi is strawberry type. It doesn't matter though, because a good a good banana crunch, and uh, it's gone. Ooh, it's got quick attack. That won't save it from the banana crunch though. I I like Barangon. I like the look it has. Uh, I like what they did with Feraldi Gator, uh, changing it into Banana Gator. And I like the fact that it has at least one good banana move. That's all I could ask for. Oh, I heard that you like to win battles. Yes. Was he gonna say to lose battles if, if I lost? Like, if he won? Probably. Hey, I defeated your henchman. Let me switch my party around. What kind of pie is this one gonna have? I don't know. But I want Darky. I want my darky boy. Uh, what be this? Mikro has their tails tied. Dealers to you, a good for nothing. Alright, bring it on then, lubber. I'll run you through myself. I overdid it, I know. That That's... Yeah. Like, the I, I said the first... The moment I said the first word, I was like, No, that's way too much. But I just kept going, you know. One of those. It's Captain Arrigado. Pie Tails. Oh, it's gonna be the evolved form, so Pie Tails, um, Pie Duck, or no, Gold Pie, maybe? And, um, Swamp Pie? Swamp Pie? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, let's try Cherry Rain. If it is, Strawberry. It's not very effective. It's not strawberry. It might be apple then. If it's apple, then nothing. If it's apple, I just. I have blue that would be good against it, but. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna razor leaf it. Yeah, gold pie. Uh, gold pie is most likely blueberry, which means... I believe razor leaf would be good, if I remember well. I do remember well. Holy shit, that was good. It was better than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> and Darky is level 34. It's Custump! Oh, Marsh Thump comes before Swampert. Yeah. 
Uh, custom. So it's apple and banana. Uh, which means I don't have anything good against it. I'm just gonna double edge it. Wow, that double edge did a lot. Oh, it's got milk shot. Which is not very effective against me, so why is it using it? Oh, does it read it? No. It would not be super effective even with the normal Pokemon types, so I don't know. Because it's a water type move, right? Water or ground. I think it, it might be ground, it might be mud shut, so it, it might be ground. Uh, but even if it's ground, I. as. Oh, well, it would have been neutral, because, yeah. Gr grass poison. It would have been neutral, but still. What? Man overboard! Arr, you win this one then, Bubba. You've run us off, but we'll be back. Okay, if you say so. Let me go to the PC. The Poké Center. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a raspberry type. Wait, is it not Erika again? Did they reuse... Did they reuse a model? That they had already used? Might be. If it is Raspberry, then I think I want blue. If, I, if I'm correct, yes, I want blue. Uh, blue, you're gonna be the leader for that one. Oh wait, no, that's not Sabrina. Okay. Your reward is an amazing battle. Okay. It's one of those. So this leads me to there. Which I can then try to go somewhere else. This just leads me forward and so does this one. Uh, this one leads me all the way to the right, and these two I have to... So there's a few that I need to try in order to know where they go. So let me just try this one. Okay, not bad. Actually, I can just... I just found how to avoid all of them and how to choose this entirely and completely. And then I just ran into this guy. Because um, I wanted to... I was curious and I wanted to see why was there a... Uh, yellow thing. It doesn't make sense. So, I still don't understand Q-Pop. I'm gonna hyperfang it. I should probably look up Q-Pop, because usually I wouldn't know. It would be in the... Um, so that's a great type move. But it would be in the Pokedex. So let me look q -pop. It says that it's Grape-type. But when I use something that is super effective against Grape in the... In the chart, it did neutral damage. Like, Cherry did neutral damage to it. Does Blueberry do neutral damage? Yes. Is Grape just broken? Are the interactions with Grape just not working? Because Water Gun should have been super effective. I am so confused. I think either the chart is lying or the game is broken. In this case, if it is broken, and that nothing is good against Grape, then Grape is not that bad a type, suddenly. <laughs> Still won't add it to the team, because I have a, van a good vanilla type. Why did I quick attack? I don't know. Popperang. Unfortunately, I wanted to keep blue for the gym leader. Um, or the battle leader. 
also. Okay, I need to switch here. Um, I'm gonna switch to Cream Cat. Uh, and I'll, I'll, I'll do the usual fake out into bite. into faint attack, I guess, since nothing does what it's supposed to do against this Pokémon specifically. I don't know if it's the whole Grape type that is broken or just Q-Pop, maybe, that is not working well. Okay, do I have something to heal? Blue. I have a Lemonade. I have Orange Puff. Uh, let's use an orange puff. Oh, I, wait, you have to give it a Pokepuff made with an orange berry when held, it restores 80 HP when held. But I guess it's in battle that it's used. It's a battle only item. Okay, let's use the lemonade. On blue. Yum yum. Good lemonade. Actually, mixing lemonade and, uh, like, blueberry strawberry juice would probably not be that bad. It would probably taste relatively good. I don't- I think it would- I think it would taste okay. I'm also a little bit weird on my tastes, though, so... Who knows. And I want to try... Okay, is there a mega... Ratty cake? Is that a thing? Let me see. And if yes, what type is it so I can give it the proper sweep? Um, Mega Goman, Ricicle, Gopai, Lily Cake, Cinnamon. No, there's no Mega Rats Cake. Okay. I'll, I, I'll have to try with something else. Um. But I have another idea of how to work the um, Mega Sweet. Alright, I have a few minutes left before the ad break, so uh, let's just go. Let's fight Nut Sabrina. Oh, it's you. Uh, I suppose I should have mentioned the spin tiles. Hope you're not feeling too sick. I actually only went through one spin tile. Like, this is a badly designed puzzle just because you can break it so easily, but. So Nut Sabrina turned into Nut Blaine. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Leader Kokai. <laughs> uh, Slug Nut? But yeah, I think it's Raspberry. Yeah. Unfortunately, my best blueberry move is not that great. At least on blue. Because I have a good blueberry move on root beer <laughs> of all of all the mons, but not on uh, blue on blue. Blue could easily have ice punch. Like, please give ice punch to blue. Uh, I'm gonna waste his parfait. Okay, ancient power is probably is probably cherry type. A high parfait. Okay. That's fine. He's wasting all of his parfait. And then I can just deal with his team. This thing has recover, just to be even more annoying. It's gonna recover again, isn't it? How do I do enough damage to... Actually, what if I don't do enough damage and therefore it doesn't click the recover button? No, it still did. Oh, you annoying little ass. Um, I'll just keep water gunning. If it's gonna recover anyway. Oh, after it did that recover, I should have done a milk shot. 
because now it's gonna recover, uh, but I won't kill. Never mind, I did kill. That's fine. We're good. Hipflan. Hipflan is orange and raspberry, so water gun should be good. Yes. Ooh. Okay. Meditate. Raises attack. Okay. It doesn't raise the defense though, so I'm fine. Hunger gas. I hate you. Yes, I'm num numbing myself. That's fine. Headbutt. Then the num num. I should be able to kill it. But then the num num will get me. But that's fine. He's got another high parfait. Oh, come on. Okay. Well, I have to rely on another Poké Sweet to finish this. I'm just gonna do as much damage as I can. I I'm not living this anyway. And it's not a Nuzlocke, so... Yeah. Headbutt. Um, who should I send? Maybe just... Cream Cat has been doing so much work here. I guess it's just Cream Cat again. Uh, unless... Oh wait, no. Darkie should be neutral against Hipflam. Yeah, there's that, but I was actually counting on the Cherry Rain hitting. Thank you. Puff Trio? That looks like vanilla chocolate. Uh, if it is vanilla chocolate and it has a chocolate move, I'm in trouble. I'm gonna hunger dust it. Of course I miss. Uproar, which is a vanilla move. But now it's stuck in uh, in its uproar, so I'm gonna double edge it. It's gonna uproar again. Um, and then I'm gonna cherry rain it. And then it sends out Lollywhack, which is broken and not working properly. So I'm going to double edge it to do as much damage as I can, even though I'm going to take some recoil. Ooh, critical hit. Wow. Okay. Uh, then that's going to... It's fine, because I was going to die anyway. But that will give me a clean switch into... I think Zesty needs some love. I know Zesty is not good against Lollywhack, um, but it's fun. You still look sick, but I'm sorry, I, I kept- I did not expect Blaine even though I saw it. I was expecting Sabrina. No, <laughs> you still look sick, but that was impressive battling regardless. Uh, this medal is all yours. Just in time for the, the ad break on top of it, because the ad break is going to be in like one minute. Or right now. Actually, it's right now, because once again, Twitch lied to me. <laughs> or the Twitch thing lied to me and said it was going to be later. Um, that's fine, I'm just going to say goodbye to you and I will explain to Twitch that they didn't miss much. Uh, so I got this really metal. And if you need to let go, there's a trash can outside. Please try not to make a mess. Oh, I see. If I need to, to puke, basically. Yeah. Alright, well, this is the end of this episode for YouTube. So, next episode, I guess, um, I'll be making my way towards Glassé City. Uh, have a little look maybe around these routes, mostly. Um, like Route 6, 18, 5, 12, 19, like all of those. And then I'll 
and in Glassy City, I guess. So thank you, YouTube, for watching. I hope that you enjoyed, and I hope that you will have a good day, a good evening, or a good night, depending on when you see this. I'll see you soon. In uh, I'll see you in just a few more days for another episode of uh, Pokemon Sweet Two. <laughs> All right, bye, guys.